Hi everyone, welcome to the Goldfish Report. This is a very special Goldfish Report, and I have, I have Gary Larrabee joining me today. How are you, Gary? Fantastic. It's good to see you. You're looking great. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> Such a pleasure to have you on, and we also have our buddy Kent Dunn, who has a special message for viewers today. How are you, Kent? Oh, doing pretty good, you know, springtime on the farm, y'all, you know, baby hatching, got animals sitting on eggs, you know, we're there and all the normal stuff. Okay, uh, can you hold that a little closer to the microphone on the computer? Yeah, that would be great. Kent, um, that sounds great, and uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a joy, though, it's a great time of year. Um, you have a, a message for viewers today, so we just thought, since Gary and I were already here having a meeting, that um, we'd we'd bring it in and, and record it and, and share it with the viewers. What, what have you got for us today? All right, I was privy to a call last night. I can't tell you who, but this, is, this goes out to the GCR community, those that are exchanging uh, when the 800 numbers come out. Listen to me very carefully. This is going to be the difference between you getting pennies on the dollar and you making the big bucks, okay? When the 800 numbers come out, you're going to give, when you call that 800 number, you're going to give people your name, you're going to give people your zip code, you're going to tell them what kind of currency you have, do not tell them how much you have, just tell them what kind of currency you have, but here is the here is the thing that will make you the money. Okay, Melissa, I, we got Ken back on the line, and we've had a little bit of a problem here, but we got it straightened out, and I want to thank you for that. And uh, Anyway, go ahead and tell us about it, Ken. All right. Okay, I was privy to a call last night, and I can't tell you who it was with, but I was privy, I was privileged to a call last night, and this is going out to the people that will be exchanging the currencies when the 800 numbers come out, okay? And I need you all to listen to me very carefully. This is what you need to do. When the 800 numbers come out, you, you call that 800 number, you give them your name, your zip code, what kind of currency you have. Do not tell them how much currency you have. Just what kind of currency you have. Now, if they direct you to a bank, this is the difference between making you the big money or you getting pennies on the dollar. You ask that operator if the bank that they're setting you up is Basel three compliant. They are going to mark that down that you ask about the Basel three compliant. And it will tip them off that you know what you're talking about. And that is going to be the difference between the big payoff and people that are just going to get small amounts of money. Okay? Well, thank you, for Kent. That's great information. And uh, if you got more to tell us, we want to hear that too. Well, you know, there's, uh, there's a private meeting right now. Pence, Cottrell, um, Mnuchin, um, uh, General Dunford, and his crew are locked in Reno right now with a Chinese elder who is actually really in a car thing. He's, you know, they just, because the Chinese workers are actually a guard. But anyway, they're locked in the Federal Reserve in Reno right now having a meeting. This RV could go off tonight up into the 15th of next month. Okay. That's the window. Mm -hmm. Right. That's the window. But, uh, but Gary, you have to tell people, please, and I repeat this, you have to tell the people that when they talk to this operator, ask them if the bank that they're setting their appointment up with is Basel 3 compliant. Right. If they're not compliant, tell them you do not want that appointment. You want a different bank. Right. Absolutely. And I, that, I is the, that is the tip off. That is the tip off to where you either get more than what they're offering at a and not have to sign a NDA 
compared to people will take a street rate. But, Gary, they're only going to do this for two weeks. After that, the regular people are just going to be getting pennies on the dollar. So you all need to know this. Right. Well, that's wonderful news. And, and I, I'll get this out to all my people for sure, Ken. And I'm sure Louisa will do the same. So, you know, I mean, the, like I said, the, the main thing that they're looking at, they want to see if people are going to ask, is the bank Basel 3 compliant? That is the tip off phrase right there that shows you know what you're doing, that you're not just somebody that got lucky and got the 800 number. Okay, that's great. Well, keep on telling us if you got anything else, Ken, because you, you, you've always got some neat stuff. Let me just ask Ken, uh, where, I mean, they, you know, had, uh, they, you know uh, the uh, ETs and the aliens had, uh, you know, had a meeting this past weekend at uh, Mount Shasta. They were supposed to go the whole weekend, and they were supposed to be talking. There's Big Daddy in the background. Uh but uh, anyway, they had a meeting, and the uh, the Orians and the Black Avians walked out on Saturday because they didn't like what was being because they didn't like what was being offered to them. So it looks like there may be an interstellar Earthal type uh, conflict between the Orians and the Black Avians and the Galactics. Uh I, you know, I don't know what to even think about that, Camp, but, I, you know, it's like that's one of those things that you know a lot more than we do about it, so. Well, I, I, I'm just trying to keep y'all, I'm just trying well, to keep y'all informed well, and about I, what's and, going on. And you, you, we're going to use your voice to speak to the people, so that'll that'll explain it and uh, and for sure. I think people might want to know again where the 800 numbers are going to come from. The 800 numbers will be given out to the uh, Intel Guru dividers, providers, okay? And they will be giving them out to their people. As soon as I get the 800 number, I will get it over to Gary, and I will have Gary make a video on it, and then it can get it out to our people. But our people need to know ahead of time to ask for the Basel Three compliant banks. Okay, well, that, that's, uh, I completely understand that, and I'll get that message out very loud and clear, Kent. Okay. Um, I, I'm, you, know, there, you know, there's so much going on. There's so much going on. I mean, there's the Galactics, are, they're all here. You know, we're just waiting for the big takedown of, you know, some of the bigger names cabal. And, in fact, uh, as of yesterday, they started writing arrest warrants for the big uh, name cabal mm -hmm. people. Oh well, that's that's good Gary. news too. Yeah. Luis, and I've been take, so, taking all the conversations, so you 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 take over for a while. You, I haven't let you speak. No, it's okay. I mean, this is your this is this is your this is your area of expertise, Gary. I'm yeah. not. I'm not. This is you and Ken's thing. I'm just well, it's, facilitating it. It's your time to ask your questions. No, that was the question I needed, and um, I think that we'll probably know more in a couple of days. Um, uh, you, Kent was very clear about. I think there's been some confusion about when, like, where people can get the 800 numbers. Right. But, um, Kent was very clear that it's there's like a two week window, and it's important that we get that information out, or you guys get that information out in a timely manner because people right. are, are going to have a very. We'll, short we'll put it out immediately. Right. That's all I've got to say. If you, if you all want, if you all want the current rates that were released, these were released yesterday, okay? The current rates, the fair trade value, the FTV, this is what they're going by now, is the, the fair trade value. The dong is at $12.71. The dinar is at $17.06. The Zim is at two thirty six plus. They haven't settled on that yet. The um, the um, Iraqi Real is at fifteen dollars and fifty two cents. The Afghani Dinar is at ten dollars and eight cents, 
and the Indiana rate is going for fourteen dollars and sixty nine cents. That's fantastic. All right, that's great. Okay, we got that. We got that. So, you know, I'm just trying to keep just trying to keep you all updated on what I find out. You know, so you're doing a wonderful job. So I hope so I hope that helps. It helps you know, so too, yeah. That's excellent. You know, and and, and by the way, this call was not this this call was not planned. Um, Gary and I happened to be uh, connecting in, in, in Zoom when Kent called. <laughs> we didn't know Kent was calling, so this is completely um, random. And uh, we had no plans. This, is, this wasn't planned, folks, just so you know. But we just said, what the heck, we're going to do it this way anyway. Right, Gary? <laughs> right. Right, Kent? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, I just, I just came, I just came in from, you know, I just came in from uh, redoing wire on one of the uh, chicken pens out there, and I thought, well, while I'm sitting here resting, I'll just give Gary a call and see if I can get through. So, you know, this is just, uh, it was just a luck and a chance for me. Well, yeah, it was timing was perfect. I think now. Well, just so the viewers know, uh, Gary's going to join Kent and I this um, Sunday on our uh, weekly POTUS update. And so that's what we were kind of meeting for was to kind of get our audio and, and, our, and our videos coordinated to do that. So, um, so we're going to see each other all again this Sunday, you, uh, Gary uh, and Kent and I. And we're gonna, it'll be a very nice time. And we're going to talk about your book, Gary. Thank you so much, Louisa. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. Uh, Lisa, Gary, there's one more thing I want to tell you all about. Okay. But now on the 15th of this month, or the 15th of next month, I'm sorry, give or take a day or two, okay, this is when the riots are starting, are supposed to break out. Now, they're going to be breaking out. This is where the main places are, okay? They're going to be breaking out in London, New York, Paris, and in Turkey. This is under the protest of Black Lives Matter, along with the Muslims, in this. And you all need to know this, stay out of them riots. Stay yeah. home. They've got the FEMA camps live right now. They're already putting people in them FEMA camps right now. Uh, yeah, that's what we need to get that warning, that warning out for sure. So, and, and, and I'll be honest with you, if this gets too bad across the country, do not, do not even blink eye if Trump puts this country under martial law. Because I've told people for months, martial law is coming, and I see it coming. If they can't get these riots under control, martial law is coming to the United States. Okay, well, that's, that's a, the word in advance, and so we need to get ready. So y'all stock up on water and food and any medicine that you need and any kind of personal items that you think you might need because the stores may be shut down for a month or two months. And they're also talking about with the floods that are going on in South America, the food production is down 32%. That means we're going to be seeing shortages of food within the next three weeks to five weeks. So you all need to know that. Mm -hmm. So go out, get you some, get you a big bag of rice, get you some beans, and make sure and make sure that you've got food in your house. Okay, then we'll get that word out to everyone too. Okay, inside, I'll give you one more. I'll give you one more thing, and then I'll let you all go. Okay. On the inside. The inside word is the CIA and the military are getting ready to clash in Washington, D.C. The military is behind Trump and the CIA is part of the dark government. And they're getting ready to clash in Washington, D.C. The military is building up for it right now. So you all need to know that. Washington, D.C. right now 
You cannot make a phone call. You cannot use a cell phone. You cannot do anything that the NSA is not listening to your call. The NSA is looking at everybody in Washington, D.C. because it comes down to the CIA versus the United States military. You all need to know this. Okay, that's, that's, thank you for that news, Kent. And, yes, sir. And if that's it, I want to thank you for this report, and I will uh, will get back to you when, and we want you to tell us when, when we, so we can get out the uh, anything that comes up. So, thank you so much for this call. It was a very timing and important call. All right, thank you, sir. Y'all have a good day now. Thank you, Kent. You too, Kent. Bye bye. Ask them if the bank that they're setting their appointment up with is Basel Three compliant. Right. If they're not compliant, tell them you do not want that appointment. You want a different bank. Right. Absolutely. And that I, I is the, that is the tip off. That is the tip off to where you either get more than what they're offering at a and not have to sign a NDA. Compared to people will take a street rate, but Gary, they're only going to do this for two weeks. After that, the regular people are just going to be getting pennies on the dollar. So you all need to know this. Right. Well, that's wonderful news, and and I I'll get this out to all my people for sure, Ken. And I'm sure Louisa will do the same. So you know, I mean the. Like I said, the, the main thing that they're looking at, they want to see if people are going to ask, is the bank Basel Three compliant? That is the tip-off phrase right there that shows you know what you're doing, that you're not just somebody that got lucky and got the 800 number. Okay, that's great. Well, keep on telling us if you got anything else, Kent, because you you know, you're always got some neat stuff. Let me just ask Kent, uh, where I mean, they, you know, had a, they, you know, the. Hi everyone, welcome to the Goldfish Report. This is a very special Goldfish Report, and I have, I have Gary Larrabee joining me today. How are you, Gary? Fantastic. It's good to see you. You're looking great. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> Such a pleasure to have you on. And we also have our buddy, Kent Dunn, who has a special message for viewers today. How are you, Kent? Oh, doing pretty good. You know, springtime on the farm, y'all. You know, baby hatching, got animals set on eggs, you know, repairing pens and all the normal stuff. Okay, uh, can you hold that a little closer to the microphone on the computer? Yeah, that would be great. Kent, um, that sounds great, and uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a joy, though. It's a great time of year. Um, you have a, a message for viewers today, so we just thought, since Gary and I were already here having a meeting, that um, we'd, we'd bring it in and, and record it and, and share it with the viewers. What, what have you got for us today? Hi, I was privy to a call last night. I can't tell you who, but this is this goes out to the GCR community. Those that are exchanging uh, when the 800 numbers come out, listen to me very carefully. This is going to be the difference between you getting pennies on the dollar and you making the big bucks. Okay, when the 800 numbers come out, you're going to give. When you call that 800 number, you're going to give people your name, you're going to give people your zip code, you're going to tell them what kind of currency you have, do not tell them how much you have, just tell them what kind of currency you have, but here is the, here is the thing that will make you the money. Okay, Melissa, I, we got Kent back on the line and we've had a little bit of a problem here, but we got it straightened out and I want to thank you for that. And, uh, Anyway, go ahead and tell us about it, Kent. All right. Okay. I was privy to a call last night, and I can't tell you who it was with, but I was privy. I was privileged to a call last night, and this is going out to the people that will be exchanging the currencies when the 800 numbers come out. Okay, and I need you all to listen to me very carefully. This is what you need to do. When the 800 numbers come out, 
answer you. You call that 800 number. You give them your name, your zip code, what kind of currency you have. Do not tell them how much currency you have. Just what kind of currency you have. Now, if they direct you to a bank, this is the difference between making you the big money or you getting pennies on the dollar. You ask that operator if the bank that they're setting you up, uh, ETs and aliens had, uh, you know, had a meeting this past weekend at uh, Mount Shasta. They were supposed to go the whole weekend and they were supposed to be talking. There's Big Daddy in the background. Uh, but uh, anyway, they had a meeting and the, uh, the Orians and the Black Avians walked out on Saturday. Because they didn't like what was being, because they didn't like what was being offered to them. So it looks like there may be an interstellar, earthal type uh, conflict between the Orians and the Black Avians and the Galactics. Uh, I, you know, I don't know what to even think about that, Camp. But I, you know, it's like that's one of those things that you know a lot more than we do about it. So. Just trying to keep y'all. I'm just well, trying to keep y'all informed well, and, and, about what's and, going on. And you, you, we're going to use your voice to speak to the people, so that'll that'll explain it and uh, and for sure. I think people might want to know again where the 800 numbers are going to come from. The 800 numbers yeah. will be given out to the uh, Intel Guru dividers providers. Okay, and they will be giving them out to their people. As soon as I get the 800 number, I will get it over to Gary, and I will have, is Basel 3 compliant? They are going to mark that down that you ask about the Basel 3 compliant, and it will tip them off that you know what you're talking about. And that is going to be the difference between the big payoff and people that are just going to get small amounts of money. Okay? Well, thank you, for Kent. That's great information. And uh, if you got more to tell us, we want to hear that too. Well, you know, there's, uh, there's a private meeting right now. Pence, Cottrell, um, Mnuchin, um, uh, General Dunford, and his crew are locked in Reno right now with a Chinese elder who is actually really in a garden. He's, you know, they just, because the Chinese workers are actually a garden. But anyway, they're locked in the Federal Reserve in Reno right now having a meeting. This RV could go off tonight up into the 15th of next month. Okay, that's the window. Mm -hmm. Right, that's the window. But, uh, but Gary, you have to tell people, please, and I repeat this, you have to tell the people that when they talk to this operator,